I'm Rachel C and you're inside acapella and we're coming to you from Boss this week, the Boston Sings Festival. Boston Sings is awesome acapella festival. It's been a lot of work but it's super rewarding. This year's Boss Festival was held at Northeastern University. Friday night was the college competition and the live car awards with the red carpet. Is that a video? Oh geez, I just posed for a video. How awkward is that? There was quite a turnout of dashing men and women dressed to the nines to celebrate another successful year of recorded acapella. I guess the highlights for me, um, definitely the collegiate competition. It's so, super exciting to see all the hard work that the collegiate group's going to uh, put into their performances. But the fact that there's so much new blood coming into these awards each year, I don't know if you realize this, but you will hear the name of five male collegiate groups. Four of these groups did not exist 20 years ago when CASA was founded. Think about that. We're not talking about an old boys network. We're not talking about it taking forever for a group to rise through the ranks. But instead, we're talking about a situation where within two, three years, a group can make it to the finals of the ICCA. It's like Oregon DeVisi did it a couple years ago. And then, oh, hey, how about a book? Oh, hey, how about a movie, right? Saturday's workshops and masterclasses taught us valuable lessons and prepared us for an amazing professional showcase with Five O'Clock Shadow and Denmark Vocal Electronic Band Postier Project. And the workshops are, as usual, going to be amazing. Bring all these really smart together so they can share their knowledge and do it in a setting where it's highly accessible for everybody. So I think it's really important for groups, high school, collegiate, even pro groups. Everyone should come to Boston. Everyone can learn something. In between workshops, we got the chance to see several groups throw an Akabom. I'm really looking forward to the network, the TV network presence that we have this time around. FOSS is a great event for you and your group to learn more about things like arranging and performing to recording and marketing. If you missed out on this year's festivities, make sure you check out casa.org for more recaps from the weekend. Those of you who have seen Pitch Perfect, you know that little scene where all the fellas put their hands in, they say one, two, three, and they sing, uh, right? Yeah. Here's your A. I want to hear, hear a beautiful chord. Okay, ready? One, two, three. That's what I'm talking about, bitches. In Aka News, the Barbershop Harmony Society celebrated their 75th birthday this April 11th and appeared on NBC's The Today Show and had a free concert webcast live from New York last night. Check out their social media sites for more information about the anniversary and the live webcast. Ben Mirren from New York spent some time crossing Aka cultural boundaries when he visited the Maasai tribesmen in Tanzania. Check out his video and blog posts in the show notes. Ben's also got an amazing live looping video online too. Definitely worth checking out. Dave Bobengarner, or DB, got to perform an impromptu beatboxing session with the legendary Bobby McFerrin. And now, this week's Grade 8. Stevie Wonder is an amazing musician that is more than often covered in acapella. Here are the top eight YouTube videos of Stevie Wonder's work done in an acapella style. Everybody's got a thing, but I don't know how to handle it. Always reaching out and Very superstitious, writings on the wall. Dum 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 